The conference hall of the International Institute of Tropical Agriculture plays host to research groups across the continent as discussions on food security in Africa take center stage. The IITA notes with concern that the population growth rate is rising at an alarming rate. The continent also has about 300 million people going hungry because of war and conflict. On the global map, there are 24 hunger hotspots in the world. 16 of them are in Africa, and something has to be done about it. These are, as they call, act of gods of you know, environmental disasters, but we also have man-made disasters from where we are. This was the factory and office building where we were hosted in Sudan and during the war, as you can see, it was unfortunately uh, burned down. You see what happens when you have a disaster, you have to clean up all the rubbish that comes into campus and, uh, you know, the water gets more and more dirty, so we have to spend more and more money on cleaning the water, that's how we want to clean the facility. Talks here are premised on the fact that agriculture is a sector that needs to be developed more, not only to make sure that the continent is food and nutrition secure, but also to make agriculture a sector that generates economic empowerment, wealth and employment for the youth population. It's very important for us, particularly in the continent, to talk about food security and nutrition security and resilience and sustainability, because unfortunately the continent it's still very much relying on import for food and does not produce enough for its own population. Whereas the, the, the potential is there. The potential is, is huge in Africa, not only because of its fertile land and natural resource management, but also for its own population. The need for greater collaboration in terms of integration and supporting national systems in the least income, low and middle income countries is important to transform the agri-food system, but poverty and inequality must get out of the way. I'm very satisfied to see really how the centers have built up experience over the years. I'm very happy to see a lot of collaboration between different centers as well. But I think we need to do more. We need to do more in terms of integration, in terms of working together, and in terms of supporting national system. The Director General of IITA, Dr. Simeon Ehui, appeals to African countries to do their best to contribute to food security, saying that the problems of food insecurity and malnutrition continue to increase significantly in Africa. My appeal is to African countries to do their best to contribute you know, to food security and uh, to combat the food security and security and hunger in their respective countries. That is the primary, that should be the primary source of funding. It's hopes that food research centers across Africa can muster the strength required for food security, but only with the support of African governments.